today is a wonderful achievement um, to be here for 10 years and to go through all the divisions and all the success of Fleetwood Town and Bond has been slap bang in the middle of it. It's uh, progressed through the years, to, you know, through the promotions and uh, people questioned each year whether he'd be able to, to go to the next level but he's proved everybody wrong every year. Generally, uh, obviously, he's been stonewall in this club for so many years, you know, and a uh, great guy to work with on the pitch, great guy to coach, you know, just, uh, just really a perfect player to have in your squad, if I'm honest with you. I don't think you'll, you'll see it probably ever again at any sort of club nowadays, but uh, it's fair play to the boy, he's been fantastic, you know, and he's, he's enjoyed his time and, and he deserves all the limelight he's getting at this moment. Pondy's probably like my bodyguard to be fair, I tend to get into a little bit of trouble and Pondy has to be there to sort me out, but no, he's a great lad. On the football side of it, he's um, gone about, goes about his business quietly and his performances speak for themselves, he's, he's always stepped up the levels. Uh, whenever the club stepped up, Pondy stepped up with him and I think that's testament to his character um, and how much he wants to improve and he's still, he must be getting on to nearly 42 now, but he's, um, he's obviously still, still trying to improve, which is testament to him. On and off the pitch, a fantastic professional, great to have around the place. Um, it's, been, uh, it's been brilliant playing alongside him. Oh, he's a good lad, he keeps himself to himself and works hard and he's uh, one of the boys. Ultimate professional, you know, a great teammate, great defender. And um, like I said, he's a role model of what he's done and where he's come from and how he's played. He's a great teammate. At the stage we're at now, he's clearly one of our first trusts and a half, so no, I think he's shown a great fighting spirit to get himself in the team. And what a fantastic achievement, um, he's done really good to get all the promotions that he has and uh, deserves all the credit he gets, And although he fancies himself a bit as a as a striker, um, thinks he's a bit like Freddie Canute, but there's question marks on that one. Yeah, probably one of, one of the closest ones I got to, uh, to get on with, like, when he's a top lad and uh, <laughs> As you can tell, like, all of that's got on with him and uh, I think what he's achieved here and over the 10 years with all the promotions, I uh, don't think it'll ever be done again by any player really. I mean, it's a great, uh, fantastic achievement, what he's done. It's amazing really, it's unheard of. Um, it's a credit to him that he's been able to adapt to um, different levels of football and um, to be honest, I think he can sort of progress even further. All the lads. All the lads love him, and you know he, he's just, he's um, he's great around the place. He, do, he does his work on his own, and works really hard in the gym, and uh, he deserves everything that he, that he gets. Pre-season, yeah, pre-season, friendly, warm and all, and uh, don't know how he's done it, but he's, uh, he's he's just fell over. But it was one of them mad ones where he couldn't, he didn't have his hands to protect himself, so it was just like a, a tree falling. It was like. On the side, it was uh, it was funny. Like I was just warming up before the game, so it was a uh, very good moment. Like and uh, couldn't stop laughing for a long time. Guys, you both played with Pondy. What's he like as a teammate? He's Pondy. Pondy. <laughs> uh, he's Pondy. He's a good lad. Oh, that one time? No, no, that was you. That wasn't Pondy. Yeah, to be fair, I never even realised you were here. <laughs> um. You got a photo of him? I haven't, mate, no. Big lad, ginger there? No, that's Robbo. Oh, no. Pondy, Pondy. Lad who plays alongside him? No, I'm just trying to think, no. Um, Crazy! What we're doing here, anyway? What we're doing here, tonight? <laughs> I don't know. No? No, I'm sorry. Sorry, I can't help. No, sorry. Thanks, anyway. Congratulations, Pondy, on your uh, testimonial year. It's a fantastic achievement what you've done for this football club. You've been a great ambassador and the time that I've known you, a pleasure to work with. So, hope you enjoy your night and hopefully you'll have a good end to the season. Congratulations, Pondy. A true inspiration to all the young players down at Fleetwood Town, mate. A true professional. Good luck for the future. Yeah, to, to be here after 10 years at all is, is, is fantastic. It's a almost unique achievement in, in terms of, uh, of league football, but to, to be here in, and performing so well as Pondy has done, it's it's fantastic, and we can only see him, uh, you know, getting better, being a, a massive part of the squad uh, for time to come. I remember Pondy coming to the club ten years ago, a bit of a big awkward lad as such, and uh, he got into the game quite early. The only thing was that with Pondy at that time was he he, he sort of tend to collect red cards quite a lot, 
because I'm sure he'd like to think now that it would be better to play a full match than play half a match and then get sent off. He wasn't as though he was dirty, but he went in, he's not afraid to go in, and even today he's, he still goes in, still goes in, and that's what he's from, the, and he's a nice lad on top of everything else.